Hello, 7th period speech class. I am Tyler Thies, and I will be demonstrating how to tune a ski. I will be talking about the before, during, and after tuning a ski. First, you need all your materials, which is wax, file guide, and, and file, clamp to keep everything together, and your iron and your scraper. First, you use your file guide, which is a three degree file guide, and you sharpen your ski. A three degree file is sharper than normal 90 degree because it comes down to a better point which is sharper. As you can see this is the top of the ski and this is the snow. When you sharpen the ski you go from tip to tail in long strides, getting all the edge. And you can feel it, look for the rough patches, and then go back and get those little spots that are still a little bumpy. Also, this file has a diamond shape groove, which hardens the edge and keeps it sharper longer. And then, after you, you do both the sides, you take the wax and you drip it on to your ski. And you do this because the crystals in the, in the snow are very abrasive your ski and it's very hard on your face which is the speed of your ski and since we're ski racers we really want our bases to be fast so you drip it on and you iron it in so that it's all across the ski And when you're done, you will have one good layer of wax throughout the bottom of your ski. And then you take off the wax because then it lets the base contact with the snow and it reduces friction. And if you leave the wax on, it creates more friction so you don't go as fast. So you scrape all your wax off. And then you're all ready to go skiing and you have a perfectly tuned ski, which will glide and will be very fast. And you will be able to carve on that ice. I have talked about before, during, and after of tuning a ski.